Go. Okay, so again, we're doing a new WISCA or PFA that's not as perfect. So Mike is in this one. He's happy, relaxed, and engaged. We're gonna try to get this for five minutes, which we do. So in this one, we get our first five minutes of HRE and SR <clears throat> consecutive. And then um, it's kind of funny. I don't know when I placed my first EO, but uh, I'm available to Mike. He figures out that when he rolls towards me on the ball, I kind of give him reactions. So that kind of becomes a game between us. But otherwise I'm just available to play and have fun um, however he would like. Okay, so I placed my EO, which on my, I'm going to draw a line. I placed my EO. He didn't respond as beautifully as last time or as quickly. So in this, you can see me in put it, turning up the heat, as we say, and escalating my EO. So I stand up, clap. I walk towards him. I tell him it's time to be done. I get no response. So I'm going to tell him to give me the iPad. I get no response. So I'm going to put my hand on the iPad. And what you don't see in the video is that he kind of elbows me a little bit. So that's when I reinforce was when I got an elbow. So that's still an R2, just a little shove. I go back to SR, but you can hear he's still engaging in those low level vocal protests. So I'm actually gonna not put my X here because he's not happy, relaxed and engaged. And I'm gonna note that there were still some lingering R2s in my reinforcement period. So I'm gonna keep this line going until I reach my SR with HRE condition. So I'm waiting, I'm available, I'm waiting. He still kind of quickly, pretty quickly returns to um, HRE here. So he's about to get back and the vocals have gone away and now he's starting to bounce on the ball again. He's checking in with me and now he's happy. I know this because I know my learner. I've done my interview, but I can, I can see he's being silly. He's playing around. We're back to HRE. So after 30 seconds of this, I'm going to mark my interval that I had 30 seconds of HRE in my SR condition without problem behavior. And when he's ready, and I think he's ready, deemed on his performance, I'm gonna place another EO. And so he remembered that we played that game earlier where he rolled towards me and got a reaction. So he's doing that again and having a blast. He's laughing. We're all laughing. See, it's pretty fun. <laughs> Trying not to corner me. <laughs> and I place my other EO. Okay, so again, I didn't get that response right away. So I escalated my EO, I turned up the heat. So I walk towards him, I get no response. He's kind of like, what? I tell him what I want him to do, and then I start to turn up the heat, and he starts to pull away from me, and I reinforce that. That's my R2 definition. So again, I had an EO, I placed, and I got a small PB, or R2. He got right back to SR condition this time. So we're gonna go right into it. We didn't have any lingering um, R2s, which is beautiful. <laughs> I'm looking for my, I'm looking for my HRE for at least 30 seconds. But again, this should be performance based. Again, he comes after me because it was so fun to get that reaction. So that's cool. <laughs> He's super happy. You can hear him smiling and laugh, or you can hear him laughing coming after me it's pretty funny <laughs> I'm gonna give a little longer an SR this time just because we're having so much fun like why interrupt something so fun he gets on his iPad I think okay maybe I'm gonna let him get engaged in this and then I'm gonna place my EO okay Mike it's time to be all done let's go do some work give me the iPad give me the iPad give me the iPad give me the iPad so I got a small R2 where he just went mmm but it wasn't enough. So I wanted to make sure that I was really checking myself and I pushed it a little farther to get that just a little bit more discreet. If you okay, see, I, I walk up to him, he kind of goes, nah. Let's go do some work. Give me the iPad. There we go. And so then now I'm gonna reinforce that because I really wanna make it clear to him that that behavior is what's gonna turn off the response or turn, get him back to SR. Super clean, so I'm back in SR. I'm looking for that 30 seconds. We have some lingering PBs. I don't know if you heard that. When you watch the video, you were, you will. After the third EO, there's some lingering PBs. So I'm gonna note that in my data. So now I need to wait for 30 seconds with no problem behaviors and HRE. Oh, we're back to HRE because it's after me again. <laughs> we're having fun. 
<laughs> Maybe too much fun. <laughs> okay, we got 30 seconds of HRE at this point. So I can place an EO at any time. So again, I didn't want to just reinforce that really low level vocal protest because I wasn't sure if it was enough. So I really wanted to make it clear to him that that clear behavior turned it off so I know exactly when I need to place my prompt when I go to um, treatment. We're back in HR, SR and he's right back to HRE going after me with that ball, <laughs> having a blast. We get to check our box that we're HRE. This is gonna go for my last EO here in a minute. Looking for that 30 seconds HRE with no problem behaviors at a minimum. And remember, this should be performance-based and what your client needs. They might need longer okay, than that. Time to be all done. You can have your way. And I reinforced on a lower behavior that time because this is a role play. 